What's up guys, welcome back to another episode of Mastering Body Language with me, the Body Language Noob. Today is going to be a Random Thoughts episode for the Random Thoughts playlist, and it's going to be about girls and their crushes. So as I grow older, I find out about more and more crushes that girls have, either on me or other friends, and they had these crushes four, five, three years ago. Have you ever had a girl come up to you and say, like, I totally had a crush on you, like, four years ago? Oh my god, I wanted to date you so much. Keyword, had a crush on you. And you're just sitting there like... So let's talk a little bit about why this is important to look at. Why is it important to listen to all the times girls had crushes on you five years ago or in high school? It's very important because the next time you go out places looking for a girl, the bar, the li you shouldn't look for girls at the library, but the library, wherever you're going, you need to have that thought in the back of your mind that some girl out there might be looking at you and wanting you to come talk to her. So the next time you go out to find a girl, look for body language that hints interest. Things like a come on smile. You, you can watch the episode where I, I talked about the come on smile. Come on smile. And things like genuine smiles, smiling with the eyes, glancing over at you and looking away when you look. Girls have a way of doing it, whereas if they were just looking at you and they looked away, it's kind of obvious they don't, they don't have interest. But when girls have interest, they do it a little differently. I'm not going to try to reenact it, I'm sorry. But they look at you and they have a way of like kind of dragging you forward. It's almost like they're trying to lure you in. They look at you, they make sure they look at you for an extended time. It's not too long, but it's longer than normal. And they kind of just slowly look away. And it's like, that's them saying, hey, you better come talk to me. And you better go talk to her. Because girls are, it's rare when they come and talk to you. Think about those times when those girls had crushes on you and you didn't even notice. It's time to look around, analyze body language, and go for times when you feel that you have a moment to land a girl. And if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. But at least you tried. At least you don't have to worry about girls coming up to you later on and saying, Oh my god, I totally had a crush on you if you just would have came up and talked to me. Just would have said something about it. We would have been dating. So a quick rundown of what girls are going to show. They're going to play with their hair. They're going to want to be close to you. They're going to come up with excuses to touch you. And basically they're going to show you different types of smiles that kind of get your brain all scrambled around. But I'm sure the next question that most of you have is, well, what do I do when this girl is giving me signals? Well, you need to go up to her. You only have about one to five seconds. If you wait any longer, then chances are you're going to have a hard time landing this girl. You already have an advantage because this girl is interested in you and she's giving you signals. But as soon as she looks at you and looks away, you need to be there, like right when she does it. And you need to talk to her. Assertive body language. Standing, feet a little more than shoulder width apart. Do not cross your arms. Do not put your hands in front of your body at, at all. Have one in your pocket maybe, but not both. And just stand firm. Make eye contact with her. And do not let your voice go up in pitch or down in pitch. Talk smooth and talk with a sort of... It's, to me, it seems like monotone, but not, not that boring, but sort of upbeat. But you don't want to be going all over the place, okay? That just shows nervousness. You want assertive body language. 
You want them you want to let them know that you're in control. And that is the random thoughts video that I had for you. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe. And pretty much everything you need to know is going to be in the description. If you really enjoyed it and you want your friends to know, share it on social media. Thanks for watching. Body Language Noob out. I don't know why I went like this, but I did.